everybody what's up everybody what's up now I know a long time I know you're from me and I'm so sorry but I've been busy and so forth but I am here with another banger video remember to like comment share and subscribe keep subscribing guys keep commenting keep doing everything that you are doing so as you see down in the title I'll be giving you guys 10 study tips because exam is out, right? Persons doing CXC, person doing CAPE, you know, you know, maybe you want a few tips of how to study or and how can you manage your time and all of that. So I'm here to give you 10 tips and I hope these 10 tips are helpful and for all those who there are doing exams, please stay calm, remember to pray and don't stress too much. So let us get into the video so tip one pick a place and time you know not everybody can study any and anywhere so pick a place that you are comfortable with and a time that you're comfortable with right set up your study space so whatever place you decide to pick ensure that you set it up formally you know or set it up a way that you are comfortable with or a way that you know you are comfortable studying that way also find your best time you can't just say you're going to study at any any time maybe that time is not um so um okay for you or maybe you have too much things doing at that time so it's okay to set a time to study so say for example you when you're coming from school um five minutes after you're coming from school they're going to get into studying right so it's, it's most importantly you should set a time and a place to study right <clears throat> tip two study every day yes study every day because let me tell you so when you study every day it keep whatever you study stays in your mind stays in your head so even when even when you're going out or you see something pertaining to what you study you're going to see you're going to see it and then you're going to eventually say hey i studied that yesterday and that's sticking my head right so it helps and it helps you to retain more it helps you to be relaxed more when you study every day and you don't have to study for long hours right you don't have to study for long hours people think that studying you have to study for one hour no you don't have to study for long hour you know you can study for five minutes mm -hmm. you can study for five minutes you don't have to study for long hours but please ensure that you study every day don't make one day passing in a study yes tip three plan your time yes you can plan it set alarms yes set alarms use a wall planner you know the good things that we put up on the wall yeah make to-do list to-do list is really helpful yes i did a to-do list and it has really been helpful it help you to manage your time wisely yeah set time limits so you know that um you know that um when you're going to study you're going to study for this part for this amount of time and after you study you're going to do something else so it's most you must um set time limit because you don't want to study for the whole day that can be really stressing and draining right so you don't want to study for the whole day so set alarms use wall planner make to do list and a to do list doesn't have to be one big so no small to do list is smaller the better right so small to do list can also be helpful yes um tip four discover your learning style whether you're audio learner visual learner or um tactile tactile learner so that means you prefer to learn by doing things which that's weird yeah but yeah so you need to find out what type of learner you are mm -hmm. so when you find out what type of what type of learner you are it will also be easy for you when you're studying right so whether you want to watch videos whether you want to do charts and so forth yeah it is easier to know what type of learner for you i am a audio learner no mm -mm. me a visual learner yes i have to see things to you know to to learn from it so yeah 
revive review and revise most importantly you can't just study and you just study and that's it no revise what you got off what you did right review it it also helps you to retain to to keep the mind you know keep it in mind right so always review do quizzes quizzes are really helpful do quizzes within your peers within your family members you know I say mommy come ask me them question and I'm sick much me get and whatever you're not get correct you go over it and see what you need to improve and so quizzes are very important um make your own study materials as well so if you want to use the 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 cards you know I always see walking around with cards here right some things yeah you can you can um flash cards yes come on flash cards flash cards are really helpful as well you can do do look of flash cards and so forth and put some questions on it and practice within your peers right practice within your peers so that is really helpful again so review and revise six take breaks it is important to take breaks you can't just study 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 so like you're not a damn things <laughs> sorry you have to take break take a little five minute break stretch your legs walk take some drink some water you know go outside take some fresh air you know you can't just say you will mad you will mad yes you can't just as my understand say you won't get the one and the twos and so but you will mad it will mad you mm -hmm. so take breaks drink some water refresh your mind you know the mind can't absorb too much guys right so drink some water take walk you walk take some fresh air you know yeah take breaks five minutes break it but at least a five minutes yeah at least five minutes take breaks ask for help tip number seven ask for help you know you can't anything that you're studying and you don't understand don't be afraid to ask somebody ask one of your teachers hey miss i didn't understand this can you go over this can you explain to me let it be more clear to me yes ask for help don't be afraid someone with some of full of too much pride man we need to dash your pride yeah don't be afraid for us it can remember you want pass you know remember you want you want to get the local ones and twos and so forth so don't be afraid to ask for help man don't be afraid no matter what nobody wants to say because some people will say every minute she goes to the teacher but no tell them say you don't business tell them say you don't business ask for help don't be afraid to ask for help always ask for help because when you ask for help it helps you to get better yes so always ask for help tip number eight stay motivated guys mm -hmm. you can't be around too much negative people that naga help you can't be around too much negative people can't be around people say oh we naga pass this they test me like a heart mm -mm, mm -mm. that's what them there that's what them there stay with positive people persons right stay with positive people them they can help you and those be the mental them people there <laughs> always come out yeah stay around positive persons and stay around people who will help you and will motivate your throat you know when you're feeling down and when you feel like you know you're 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 over you're overwhelming your mind too much stay with persons and say hey relax take it easy don't go too hard them people the man them people they so always stay motivated tip nine it says add it up i don't know what that means <laughs> so it says there are heaps of apps out there for helping students with all aspects of study have a chat with their friends and teachers or lecturer to see which apps they recommend oh oh it says app app sorry guys app up it up <laughs> up it up so this is basically saying that um there are apps out there that you can go through and that can help you when you're studying that that is true me so i look maths up them you know them when you get the, the local maths them yeah man that that good for you man that good for you this is a good thing yeah so there are different apps out there that can help you when you're studying so you can also go to persons that you think you know that knows these app 
or my nose is up. Go to them and say, hey, what? give me some apps that I can use to help me, you know, do these things. So, up it up. And finally, tip number seven, look after yourself. Most importantly, most importantly, look after yourself. Take care of yourself, guys. Eat properly. Someone is stressed when it comes to this time, and I totally understand, but you have to ensure that you're you're eating properly some people lose weight when they when it comes to examiner no man lose good good amount of weight no true true so you must ensure that you eat properly get enough rest get enough rest guys get this is definitely especially before exam get enough rest yes get enough rest so eat properly get enough rest exercise as well exercise helps i don't mean about exercise but exercise help you know do look at jogging do look at push up or look at foolish so exercise help guys so always remember um and it also says don't reward yourself with too many surgery or fatty snacks or push yourself to study late into the night it's a late night studying guys you can take a hold on you and some persons like some persons prefer to study at night because they feel as if it like it is more quiet and it more it is more reserved and that is true because at night late night everybody gonna them bed you know no much disturbance you know so that is true but don't practice it too much because then when you study late at night you're not going to get enough rest to wake up the next morning for class or for the exam right so don't study late at night so those are the 10 tips that i have for you i hope those tips were really helpful and i hope you guys learned from those tips um i have another something coming up next similar to this video so stay tuned and remember to follow me on all social media platforms they will be done at the bottom of the screen and the link will be in the description and remember to watch out all the video guys yeah watch out everything come here sweet man time hot tea hot man yes yeah, so anyways thank you guys for watching and i will see you guys in the next video